Recreational marijuana sales are growing. The main office of cannabis policy says in 2021, businesses made 82 million in sales. Last year, that number nearly doubled to just under $159 million. A main business that sells both recreational and medical marijuana is doing things a little differently. Yeah, high Tide Organic Cannabis in South Portland showed our and Baldridge how they are trying to save money on their water bill and also better the environment at the same time. You know, if you're not learning, you're not growing. Skip Sullivan is the co-founder of High Tide Organic. He started from scratch on a much smaller scale grow operation in 2017. We wanted to, from the very beginning of the company, um, bake uh, um, sustainability into sort of the, the DNA of the, the business as we um, grew. In March of 2022, he began to build the grow operation he has now. The unfortunate downsides of the cannabis industry is uh, the, the generally the, the generally um, large uh, carbon footprint. Skip tells me he's focused on using water more wisely. We designed an irrigation system that would um, both reduce um, water use at the front end, but then also reclaim that water uh, to be reused uh, to, to feed the plants, essentially. He's doing that by tapping into the plant's natural ability. Uh, so what that means is instead of like watering a, an entire room, which is at this scale what you would have to do in any kind of practical sense, um, the irrigation system is basically giving the plants what they need when they need it. And so what that means is rather than using hundreds of gallons of water all at once, they're essentially sipping. His work is getting noticed. South Portland gave High Tide Organic the city's sustainability award for 2022. Very bright and eclectic guy, knows a lot about a lot of different things in terms of uh, putting these sustainable practices in place. This is a bit different from some of the prior vocations he's been involved with, and he's really researched it and done a great job. About 70% of the water that we're putting into the uh, beds to feed the plants, we're getting back through the uh, air. The irrigation is one of many organic practices that Skip put into effect, but he's not stopping there. The sky's the limit. He hopes to install solar powered roofing to lower electricity costs in the near future. In South Portland, Ann Baldridge, New Center, Maine.